Uh, we're going to play four pieces for you. Well, we're going to play three more pieces for you today. All of the four. All four compositions were um, originally written for for the same band, or at least uh, um, uh, different versions of the same band. In 1965, Thad Jones, a trumpet player and composer, left the Count Basie band and uh, moved to New York to um, uh, concentrate his work on the studio scene. And Mel Lewis, drummer, left the uh, Stan Kenton Ensemble, also to work in the studios of New York. And both of them got together and formed a new big band, which uh, they wanted to, um, for which they got together. Uh, some of the finest musicians um, in New York, and pretty quickly they got um, a gig for the band at the uh, Village Vanguard, uh, played there on Monday nights. And that's a tra tradition that um, has continued until this day today. Um, that, yeah, even though Fat Jones and Mel Lewis have both uh, since passed on, um, the band has stayed together. And um, if you get an opportunity um, to uh, to be in New York, there's no. Uh, there's really nothing I can recommend more on a Monday night than to go see that band play. We're going to play uh, four pieces from them. One from, uh, uh, well, the, uh, the first one was um, from the original repertoire from the 1960s. We're going to close the set with a piece from the 1970s. Um, next, you're going to hear a Bob Brookmeyer arrangement of uh, Hoogie Carmichael's Skylark from the 1980s. And, uh, then, uh, and our third piece will be, um, uh, the band's now called the uh, Vanguard Jazz Orchestra. And uh, it'll be a uh, Jim McNeely composition from that. Um, so this uh, uh, this uh, piece, Carlin, features uh, Joe Kwan on the upper side.
Uh, next, we'd like to feature our 